Martin Hyatt is here with something I don't think any home can go without this summer. Whether you are tailgating, whether you are camping, whether you're in the car, on the boat, or just hanging around in the yard, if there is a power outage or you just don't have enough extension on that extension cord or everyone's plugging in their devices, you need a backup power source. And that's exactly what this is. You can plug in 16 different devices with a super powerful portable power station. In fact, it is 40,000 milliamps. Yeah, we're talking, it can charge your cell phone eight to nine times. You can choose from the purple, the black, or the blue, and it is brand new from Idea Play. We're going to give you five flexible payments to get this home. We're also going to give you an opportunity to enjoy free shipping and handling. That saves you another $12. But what's so cool, this is like bringing the outlet with you. Mm -hmm. You don't have to plug this in. This can go anywhere you can go. So really, it's like a party in a power station for sure. So where is the party, Justin Hyatt? And where are we going? Well, I'll tell you, well, I want to go with Jeanette to Orlando, yeah, Florida. That sounds because, fun. But I was just sitting here thinking, you know, what we normally do when we go traveling is, well, we have all of our devices with us, right? And normally we've seen these power banks that we bring because we need to charge our phones when we're out traveling or maybe we're charging our, our uh, headphones when we're traveling on the plane or wherever this is a power station but this we've graduated this is the mac daddy of the power banks because instead of 2000 milliamps you're looking at 40,000 milliamps right here and you're not just charging one device you can charge six devices at the same time you have four usb ports right here this blue one right here is a quick charge port which will allow you to actually charge your phone nearly twice as fast you have two ac outlets so plug a lamp in if you lose power for the day. Plug a fan in because it's summertime and if you lose power, the first thing you think is it's hot. So plug a fan in here. You can plug a little TV in here. I mean, well, there's so many different things you can plug in, but again, I think it's the versatility of having, having something so slim and portable to be able to bring with you so that you can have everybody having a party power station, <laughs> a party charging station, instead of just you charging your own devices. This isn't one of those big, heavy gas generators right. where I would feel really intimidated using, yeah. right? I mean, there's fumes, mm -hmm. there's some, some danger and some risk involved when you use a gas generator. And most of us, if you live in an apartment like I do, or you rent, or you have a condo, or a small home, you probably don't even have room for a gas generator. I was just gonna say, you, not even that you have room, you can't, you can't have a gas generator, period, in, in a place like that because of the fumes. So that's additional cost. This is something, when it comes to the size of being portable, it's also great and easy to store. So if you are a renter in an apartment or condo, maybe you have a home office. What happens when you lose power and you have your home office? You can actually power a laptop and charge it to fully, full charges. Your tablets, you can charge a phone eight to nine times completely. So if you lose power for a week and you just want to use your power station to be able to charge those devices for a full week and just leave it for that, I think that's fantastic. But again, when you're done with it, where you put it? You can put it in a bag. You can take this with you. It's something that's great for all those emergency situations. Even if it's the emergency, like we were joking, you see 10% left on your phone. That's to some of us as an emergency. You can use it for that and for even health emergencies as well. Yeah, let's talk about that. I mean, I, I know my father-in-law uses this. It's a CPAP machine. This is actually a nebulizer. This okay. is actually my personal <laughs> nebulizer I've had. I've had asthma my whole life. Growing up in Florida, hurricane season, uh, of course, we, you know, even just the rainy season, you lose power, it doesn't matter when. And of course, I actually ended up having an asthma attack. And instead of going over to the hospital, rushing over to the hospital, next thing all you have to do is plug it right here into your power station. Um, all you have to do, plug it in. And then here we go, plug it on, turn it on really quickly. I gotta turn the AC unit on. Ba -ba -ba -ba. And then here we go. And now you can hear it going on. This is the thing, you can have a CPAP machine, mm -hmm. but what about a nebulizer? You start thinking about all this, maybe a mini refrigerator for any of your medicine that you have. Maybe it's mm -hmm. insulin, my sister has type one. Make sure all that medicine stays cool. So it's the fact that it's fun. Sure. But when it comes to serious situations like that, emergency situations, if it's a power outage for a day, you can still have all of those necessities. Sure, especially if you're a new mom. A happy Mother's Day, by the way. Yes. But what if you have breast milk that needs to be refrigerated? And most of us will face a power outage this summer. I mean, it's just a matter of time. Maybe it'll be just sort of a blackout because mm -hmm. everyone's running their air conditioners right. at the same time. Maybe it's a brownout. I've, I lived through three days in New York City in August in one of the largest blackouts in the city's history. Let me tell you one place you don't want to be in the middle of August without power is New York City. I don't think anything could be hotter. And let's not mention everything else that you smell when you open up your windows. It was tragic. But we didn't have this 
back in, I think that was like early 2000s. We didn't have a power bank. Yeah. If you were out of power, you were out of luck. Well, I right? think this is this is really just evidence of how far advanced technology has gotten because not only do you have something that's going to be able to power all your devices, but you know it's something that you can take with you that's going to be able to power your laptop, your tablet, and then power that fan. So when you're living in downtown, you know, in, in New York, yeah. and all of a sudden you got no power, you can run a fan up to nine hours on just one charge with this. Not only that, when we come back, you know, we had shown you if you lose power, you can plug a lamp in. You don't even need to because this will end up being one of the longest lasting flashlights that you have because with 40,000 milliamps, you can see right here, we got that flashlight going. Not mm. only that, but when it comes to being able to be a travel companion, take this with you because it even has SOS. We'll even dim the lights for you. You have SOS, you have a bright LED you can see right there. You have a strobe light. So if you wanna have this on the side of the road, take this with you, you're traveling, God forbid something happens, mm -hmm. take this out at night. And if you're on the side of the road, that, this way cars can see you. And then again, you have that flashlight just to be able to see what's going on. So again, tailgating, camping, th start thinking of all those different ways you're gonna yeah. be able to use this. I'll I'll tell you what, we're not gonna give up. Our devices, anytime <laughs> soon. And all of our favorite devices require power. Whether it's your cell phone, or your camera, or it's your tablet, mm -hmm. or it's your iPad, or it's your computer, or it's your laptop. You know, we're charging everything. Everything needs a charge now. So whether you're just in the backyard, or you're sitting on your balcony, right. or maybe you're just at uh, on your patio. Maybe you're, you're taking the kids to the park, and you wanna play your music, and you wanna have a party at the beach. or maybe Maybe you're having a family picnic and you're getting the whole gang together. This is what you need so everyone can plug in everything that they need. And the best part is it's so small. It's so lightweight. Mm -hmm. In fact, uh, let me give you the dimensions here. It's about 10 inches by about 8 inches and it's less than 2 inches thick. So it's about the size of a hardcover book. If you have room for a hardcover book, you definitely have room for this. It weighs only 3 pounds. So it's not heavy. And what kind of things can we plug in? Talk about all those different inputs again. For yeah, everybody. so since we have the charge, so we have those three USB. Again, you, I'm gonna move my hand real quickly. You can see we can have six devices charging at the same exact time. You can see the little LCD display. It'll show you how much battery power you have left. It'll even tell you what you have plugged in at the same time. Two AC outlets. This little blue one right here, that USB port, that is a quick charge outlet. So you'll be able to charge a phone or a tablet twice as fast. But I love about having these AC units AC plugs because you can charge a laptop two full charges. With the USB ports, you can charge your phone up to eight full charges as well. But the thing is, is that you can have six devices plugged into this at the same time time. So you can have a lamp plugged in, you can have a fan plugged in while you're still charging all of those different devices. And if you're out partying in the bar in the backyard or having a barbecue, and what happens when that that Bluetooth speaker starts to die? Plug it in mm. with your phone, and then I think it's just the party continues yeah. to go on. I know, the party's over if there's no music. The party ends when the music Everyone ends. goes, aww. I mean, <laughs> hey, you gotta be the life of the party. Uh, let me show you some more features, and it mm -hmm. includes the charging times too. So you can check those out. You'll see that on the left side of your screen. Now, this is not gonna charge your full-size refrigerator no, in a blackout. No, we're talking about small appliances. Right. Now, maybe a little mini refrigerator, mm -hmm. uh, but this is something that, this is for all the fun little devices. We're gonna show you, you know, we're gonna be able to blow up an air yeah. mattress, but we have a full, Ooh, we have a, a TV. This is a TV that's, this is, that's what's plugged in right now. It's a really large size television. Great for entertainment, of course, mm -hmm. outside, maybe in the backyard. First thing I did was I plugged in my TV projector with my Roku, and I had my whole little, my whole little entertainment center mm -hmm. out back. So you can do that with your TV, but I think with emergency situations too, what's the one thing that we want to do? We think of yeah. food, water, but also make weather. sure we have the, we know where the tra we're tracking the weather. So whether right. it's winter storms or the summer storms, the hurricanes, you get to see exactly what's going on, and then still be able to keep the line of communication going with charging mm -hmm. your phone as well. Because I think that's the moment of panic for everybody. As soon as the as soon as the power goes out mm -hmm. or they flicker, you're like, oh, is my cell phone charged? Do, can I can I use my tablet? Am I going to be able to plug in the radio mm -hmm. and hear local news? Or maybe there's tornado warnings, or maybe it's an ice storm, or maybe the tree fell, the local power line, or maybe you want to keep track of the local weather on the local news. If I mean, all you need is really a. a one of those little satellite dishes in your tea, in your window, yeah. and you're good to go. You don't even need cable. You don't need the internet anymore. If you have a power station, let me remind you, there's our th there are three colors for you to choose from. Uh, I mean, they all work the same, but it's fun to have uh, kind of a cool color. We have it for you in black. We have it in this purple color. It's kind of an eggplant purple, and we have it for you in blue. Today, we have a price break that's 40 
$20 off our regular price. Today we have five flexible payments, just $28 a month. And today we're also doing shipping and handling free. That's saving you a total of $40, $52 off. So $52 off if you're placing your order today. And I know it's a uh, Mother's Day, so happy Mother's Day to all the moms out there. But if you're thinking, you know what? This would be great for the dads. This would be a perfect Father's Day gift, or maybe a graduation gift. Is there someone in your life, uh, a young man, a young woman who loves to go camping, who loves to go hiking, who loves to be out on the beach, who likes to take long road trips? Uh, let me tell you, if you're on a road trip, almost everyone is gonna wanna plug in their device mm -hmm. or their movies or their tablets or the GPS, there usually aren't this many outlets in the typical vehicle, right? <laughs> yeah. I mean, that, that would just get you through a road trip, exactly. for sure. Yeah, if you got four people on the car, there's only a certain amount of devices you can plug in. <laughs> We're and always and arguing, like, who has less charge yeah, just on their say, phone, what, right? How much do you have on okay. your phone? Okay, okay, oh, so I get to plug mine in first? Yeah, okay. <laughs> exactly, <laughs> but you, you said, I think, you know, with dad, it's great, but how many times as a, as a mother do you hear, mm -hmm. mom, Mom, my phone's dying, or mom, my, you know, my, the, the new the video game console is, is dying, yeah. or my headphones are dying, my tablet's dying. You can be the hero mom with this device, you but can. if you are traveling, I think you're traveling with all of those devices, right? And we have the Samantha Brown, I believe this is the under the seat mm -hmm. bag, um, but I wanted to show you just the, the uh, idea of being able to travel with this, because this is so small that you can literally put this in a purse, take this with you, and put this underneath the seat, uh, um, because in the airport, of course, we're, we're charging, we're rushing all over the place, is nothing like, and she mentioned it, when yeah. you got your phone with your ticket, right, and it starts dying and you never printed it out, bring this with you. And then what I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna move the bag really quickly, because I wanna show you all the different things that we can do with this. You talked about camping, but this is immediately gonna turn camping into glamping, because all we have to do is, it's one touch of a button. This is not a generator that you're thinking, okay, I'm gonna have to put gas in or crank it. I'm gonna turn it on very simply. There's a little AC button right here. This turns on and activates these two AC outlets. And what I'm gonna do is I'm actually just gonna take this and act as though I went camping and blow up an air mattress. And while I'm doing that, and the air mattress is blowing up, I can grab a fan, okay? <laughs> because, yeah, we no, might be- this is my kind of camping. I was gonna say, we might I be- I get an air mattress and a fan and my cell phone. This is the only way to get you camping. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> okay, am I gonna have an air mattress? Will there be some type of AC unit, right? <laughs> so now we can go ahead and plug this fan in, get it going, and now we have two different devices going at the same time. We got an air mattress blowing up, we got a fan, and we still have four USB ports where we can be charging our phones, our tablets, yeah. our Bluetooth speakers. I think I it's mean, awesome. That's one thing we're never gonna wanna be without our tablets, our cell phones, our charging mm -hmm. stations. And this is a portable charging station. Even if you just like to have a portable office, maybe you like to take your work out to the back deck. There's not an outlet back there. Maybe you wanna take your laptop to the coffee shop and you don't wanna have to be tethered to a wall. Uh, there's only so many seats in the airport mm -hmm. with outlets. There's only <laughs> so many seats at the coffee shop near an outlet. Uh, last time I checked, most playgrounds don't have no. power stations, so if you're there with the kids and maybe you're thinking, hey, while I'm watching the kids, I could get some work done on my laptop or at least, you know, charge my cell phone. Wherever you go, you could bring your power with you. It's really powerful. It's called an on-the-go generator. So without gas, without fumes, without anything that you have to worry about, all you